Hi everyone. So today's agenda is finding out the issue solution. And the issue is sometimes when we have a, a trigger on a platform event, and if we have some debug logs set in that platform event trigger, we are just not able to see it in developer console or in debug logs. So how to solve that? So let's get started. Now, let's say I have a trigger on account, like you can see here, and it's a simple trigger. I have not followed all the good practices over here because it's just a small learning exercise. Now, the trigger is on account and on before update, I've just inserted a debug log which says account trigger. So, I'll quickly go and edit a account. Let's say I put the customer priority and I save it. Here you can see that a debug log got generated. Now let me open it. So here you see this is the debug statement that I had put. Okay. Now next thing that we are going to do is I've created a platform event here whose name is platform event one. In that platform event, I have a simple description field. Now what am I doing is in Salesforce, I'm creating a trigger on this platform event. So what is the name of this event is platform event one. So as you could see, I have a trigger on platform event one. Here it is. After it is inserted, after a platform event is published. So after insert, this trigger gets fired. And what I'm doing is I'm just displaying the PE dot description. How am I going to fire this trigger? So let's write that in the account trigger. Uh, just one minute. So on update of an account, what I'm doing here is I'm just coming inside, creating a platform event instance, populating the description with the name and just publishing it. After it is publishing, we are writing the debug log which says event published and once it comes inside the trigger of the platform event the moment it is triggered it should come inside and display this pe dot description okay as simple as that now let me first delete this log okay now let's come here again let's edit the account record Okay, so I've edited the annual revenue and I'm going to save it. Now you see there is a debug log that got generated. It says account trigger event published and other logs that I've put. But as you could see that this debug statement that I put in my platform trigger is not available over here. Now how to solve that? And why can I not see the debug statement that I've put in my platform event? Now the catch is whenever a platform event gets fired, you cannot normally see the debug logs of it. You need to set the debug log. Now how to do that? You need to set a new log. And here instead of user, you need to set automated process. And just set the time and debug level. Okay. That's how you do it. Now, let me show you. I've already set up a debug log called process automated. So whenever a, a, a platform event runs and whatever debug logs that you have put inside that platform event trigger, you can only see it via this automated process. You need to set it up in the debug log. Now, let me again try to edit the account. So let's say we change the priority and let's save it. Okay, the moment we save it, first we are going to look at the account log, account trigger, event published and so on. But again, I cannot see my platform event log. So I'm going to refresh this.
and let's view this log. So here I can see this is what I displayed as the debug log on my platform event trigger. So that's about it. If this video helped, please like, share and subscribe. I also have one more channel which is linked on my Instagram bio. I need your support and please like, share and subscribe that channel as well. Thank you so much.